Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to integrate x squared plus 2x times cosine x. For this integration, we need to know integration by parts formula, which is u times v minus integral of v times dv. So for this integral, we need to define what the u and dv is. Our u will be x squared plus 2x and our dv will be cosine x dx. Why did we pick this as u? Because it's easy to differentiate. And we picked cosine x dx as our dv because it's easy to find antiderivative. So if u is x squared plus 2x, then du is the derivative of this function, which is 2x plus 2. And dv is cosine x dx, that's how we picked. And v will be the antiderivative of this function. So differentiate this, integrate this. Let me make a small chart here for trigonometric functions. This is cosine x direction, negative cosine x direction sine x direction and negative sine x direction. Whenever you differentiate trigonometric function, you go to clockwise. So this is the derivative of the function. Whenever you integrate, you go to counterclockwise. So this is the antiderivative. So, integral of cosine x is sine x. Now we are going to apply the formula, u times v. So our u is x squared plus 2x, and our v is sine x, minus integral of v du. v is sine x, du is 2x plus 2 dx. So we can write 2x plus 2 to the front and sine x here, dx. Now we are going to apply another integration by parts formula here. This time our u, if you prefer you can pick up different letter, our u will be 2x plus 2, then our du will be 2dx, which is the derivative of this function and our dv will be sine x dx so integral of sine x is negative cosine x that will be our v negative cosine x so again differentiate integrate now we're going to apply formula again here Let's rewrite up to here, x squared plus 2x sine x minus u times v. So 2x plus 2 times v is negative cosine x. We can write negative here, cosine x minus from the formula v times du, integral of v times du. So negative 2 cosine x dx. Now we know how to integrate cosine x. We are fine. Let's clean up, distribute the negative sign and write the final answer. So x squared plus 2x sine x negative times negative makes here positive so plus 2x plus 2 cosine x integral of cosine x is negative sine x but we can pull this negative sign to the front so it makes here positive so this is positive cosine x and integral of positive cosine x is positive sine x 
and this negative sign distributed makes it negative in the end. So negative 2 sine x and plus c because this is indefinite integral. So this is our final answer. Thank you for watching.